here uh, on this uh, session we are going to be learning how to make autobase option number two you know means um, in autobase we have two options you know uh, one is to do the complete autobase and then you know flow along the cur um, surface automatically and this option which I showed you on the pre previous video on this video I'm going to be showing you how to make just the base and then you make uh, whatever you want on the base and then later on you can flow it because that le that uh, reduces the the time of uh, loading the the object onto the surface so that you can work faster example um, you know um, choosing a men's ring um, I'm showing a men's ring, men's ring because it's a bigger example. Um, you can see better. Okay, let me take this. Okay, okay. Um, put it in the green. So that is very clearly visible. It's now one prior uh, part. So what we have to do is just click on that and explode it on command line uh, type explode see it will just explode all the parts see this is one part and this is one part so what we do is we take this part and then click smart flow auto base it will just create the base it will not um, it is not a fully functional auto base so what you are here you have to do is you have to just keep on placing whatever you want. So here see it won't appear here. It won't update the the base surface until you go here um, you go here smart flow base this is the base and that is its destination so then it is updating so this will uh, not disturb you during the working process um, you know keep on updating one product at a time so that that leads to slow in the system so this is an option number two this uh, I would prefer to use this because you know once you are ready then you can go ahead and um, you know surface it onto your uh, product okay um, next uh, you know uh, you keep one uh, you know become a member of this group and you can learn more and any member from matrix I can post it here the videos so that you know new people can learn and then enhance their skills thank you